Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you the game between Pegoraro and Trotto. This very beautiful chess game was played in Italy in 2004. Pegoraro had white pieces and he started with e4. Trotto played c5, Sicilian defense, knight to f3, d6, d4, c takes on d4, knight takes on d4, knight to f6, knight to c3, and now a6, going for neither of variation of the Sicilian defense. Bishop to g5, e6, f4, b5, white to move, what would you do? Pegoraro played e5 attacking the knight, d takes on e5, f takes on e5, threatening pawn takes knight, knight is pinned, can't move, is there a solution for black? Yes there is, queen to c7, white to move, queen to e2, why not pawn takes knight? If pawn takes knight, then queen to e5 check. And after bishop to e2, queen takes bishop on g5. That is why Pegularo played queen to e2. Knight from f to d7. Pegularo castled queen side. Bishop to b7. This is a very interesting moment of the game. Play with white pieces. Pegoraro came up with an interesting plan. Queen to h5. What is so interesting about this? Well, he's allowing black to capture the pawn on e5. Would you capture the pawn on e5 or not, if you had black pieces? Black would love to develop the bishop and castle, but it doesn't work, for example. If bishop to c5, then knight takes on e6, attacking the queen and the pawn. So, Trotto captured the pawn. Now, bishop on g5 is pinned. White to move. What would you do? Well, this is the most interesting moment of the game, I guess. Please pause the video and find the best move for white. What did you find? Pego Raro played a brilliant move. Knight takes on e6. Black to move. Black considered queen takes knight and didn't like it. He played g6. What's wrong with queen takes knight? Let's see what happens. If queen takes knight, can you see the best continuation for white? What was black afraid of? Then bishop to c4, attacking the queen, intending rook from h to e1. If pawn takes bishop, then rook from h to e1 is winning. If queen takes bishop, then rook from h to e1 check. And after bishop to e7, rook takes bishop, winning for white. So in the game, Trotto played g6, attacking the queen. What now? How would you continue now if you had white pieces? Perhaps saving the queen comes to mind. Like move queen to h4. Looks very natural, doesn't it? Pegoraro found another brilliant move. Can you guess the move? white to move. What is the best move? Pegoraro played knight 
to C7, check. What else but to capture the knight? Then white to move. I guess you can see the move for white now. Queen to E2, check. Queen to E5. Knight to E5 is not much better. White to move. White played the move and black resigned. The move is queen takes queen. Black resigned in view of discontinuation. Knight takes on e5, then rook to d8. Check. Mate. What a brilliant game. And let's go back to this very interesting position. This is the position. Did you find this brilliant? move knight takes on e6 and what about this position did you find knight to c7 if you found both of these moves congratulations and that is all i hope that you enjoyed watching this video i wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now